Hey school family, Miss Sarah here, and I brought some magnet tiles because I want to make some patterns with you. So a pattern is something that repeats again and again. So it might go red, blue, red, blue, red, blue, or it might be up, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down. Sometimes we clap patterns, like we'll go clap. we go hmm, what about let me think how about tap tap clap tap tap clap those are all patterns so what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna make a pattern with the magnet tiles and I want to see if you can guess what kind of pattern I'm making I'm gonna make two kinds of patterns I might make patterns with the shapes so maybe I'll do like hmm, maybe I'll do square triangle square comes next? Oh yeah, triangle. Square, triangle, square, triangle. What's next? Square. You got it. Square, triangle, square, triangle, square. Um, so if you see me doing that, I might mix up the colors. So that would be a shape pattern. Then I'm making the patterns based on the shapes because I'm doing square, triangle, square, triangle. That's going to be a shape pattern. So if you see that, you can say it's a shape pattern and you can even say you can say square triangle square triangle or I might do a different kind of pattern another pattern I might do is using the colors so pay attention if you see me using colors let's see if I can think of one right now to show you maybe I would do like I would do blue orange blue orange and it wouldn't matter, it doesn't matter what shape it is, it just matters that I get blue. So, so far I have blue, orange, blue, orange, what comes next? Blue. So I want you guys to try to figure out if I'm trying to do a shape pattern or a color pattern. And you can tell me what it is. So I'm not going to tell you at first, but then we can talk about it. I'm going to need a minute to think. Hmm. Your job is to be the pattern detective. And I'm going to be the sneaky pattern maker. Let me think about what I want to do here. Okay. I know what I want to do for this one. These are really big. Hmm. What do you think my pattern is on that one? You got it! It's like red, purple, red, purple. You got it. What if I did this? Now I made it go up, down, up, down. That's my pattern. Oh, you guys are so good at this. Or if I turned it like, I could turn it like that. Huh, there's so many patterns you could make. I wonder what patterns you could make at home. You could draw them or you could make them with things around your house. Okay, I need to focus. I'm gonna make another kind. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. Okay, here we go. Okay, I have it in my head. Okay. What kind of pattern do you think I made? Do you think it's on the colors or the shapes? You got it! I made a shape pattern this time, so it's square, triangle, square, triangle, square, triangle. See? The colors didn't matter. I mixed some of them up. But the shapes mattered to me, so that was a square triangle pattern. I could also turn the triangles down like this. Ooh, that looks really cool, too. Okay, let me try another one. Maybe I'll make it a little bit tricky, 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 tricky. Let me think about it. Okay. Don't look. Don't peek at me. Don't peek at my patterns. Are you peeking at my patterns? <laughs> All right. I think I almost have it. I think this will be good. I'm going to try my best. Okay. I got this. Okay, here we go. Do you notice anything? Who 
it over. I think I'm gonna make my pattern touch this time. So I can make it longer. What do you think? What do you see? Pattern detective? Hmm. Do you think it's a color pattern or a shape pattern? Yeah, you're right, it's a color pattern. What colors do you see? Purple, blue, purple, blue, purple, blue, purple, blue, purple. We got it, we did it. All right, let me do one more. I'm gonna try, okay, let me think about it. Okay, last one. This one might be a little tricky. Let me see. What can I do? I think I'm gonna do it like that, yeah. Okay. I gotta scoot him over. I keep running out of room. Do you notice anything? What do you think? What are your predictions about this pattern? This is kind of a tricky one. Being a little tricky here. Okay, what do you think? Do you think it's shape or color? I think this one is a shape pattern. It's tricky because I used all triangles, but this is called an equilateral triangle because it has the same size, same length on all sides, it's equal. And I think this is an isosceles triangle. If not, please let me know. So I did this kind. I'll use, um, I'll use the fancy words and I can use another word too. So I did it equilateral, equilateral, isosceles, equilateral, equilateral, isosceles, equilateral, equilateral, isosceles, or small, small, big, small, small, big, small, small, big. So that is my pattern. Very, very cool. Thank you for playing patterns. Your patterns are a great math tool. And if you don't have magnet tiles at home, that's okay. You can draw patterns. Let me try to draw one for you. Whoa! I could draw, let me think. What if I drew heart, star, heart, star, Heart comes next. Star. That's called an A, B, A, B, A, B pattern. You can make, you could do two, and then one I'm going to do dot, dot, line, dot, dot, line, dot, dot, line. That, I think it's an A, A, B. I'm learning my patterns too. But anyway, patterns are a great way to practice math. And I would love to see you make a pattern at home with whatever you have. You could use, uh, Cereal boxes, you could use shoes, you could use anything. Patterns are so much fun. You could even see patterns on your shirt. I think I have a pattern on my pants. It's like black, white, blue, pink, blue, white, black, some kind of pattern. Show me a pattern in your house, maybe on your shirt, maybe something that you make, you draw, I'd love to see. Have a great day, mathematicians, see you later.